From the Arts Hub of Brockville, I'm talking with artist Pat Markovich, and she's going to be telling us about an upcoming art sale and show. Or is it art show and sale? Art show and sale. Okay, we'll go with that. <laughs> That's right. We want to have we'll people come in and enjoy the art, yes. and if they want to buy it, great. Yeah. And when is this happening? This is happening um, on a very busy weekend in Brockville, Friday, November the 25th, from 4 p.m. until 8 p.m., Saturday the 26th, from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. So we'll get you out in time to see the Santa Claus Parade. And then on Sunday the 27th, from noon until 4 p.m. Where? It is, it is at uh, St. John's United Church in Brockville, 32 Park Street. It's the corner of Park and King. Uh, the parade will be going right by the front doors. Yes. And it's in the lower hall. So there's a fully accessible entry into the uh, gallery. Um, so awesome. very easy for everyone. Good. Mm -hmm. And who are the artists? Who is who's going to be featured? We've got a dozen artists. Mm -hmm. um, some have been at the Tall Ship show that we had in June. Others are new. So I'm going to just kind of run through the list. We've Please. got um, Ida Brown. Mm -hmm. Ida is uh, new to the show. She's, she's a local artist and does amazing work um, in uh, clouds and uh, also in woods mm -hmm. um, and she does wonderful color contrasts and wonderful contrasts in texture in oil paint. Uh, next is Belia Brandau mm -hmm. who is not a stranger to the arts no. community here and she does incredible uh, still lives, mm -hmm. florals yes. and uh, still life compositions, beautiful detail. Uh, the next person is Brenda Clark, and Brenda has done a number of uh, paintings. She's very much inspired by the nature that uh, she sees when she's out. So she's done a lot of Algonquin paintings, as well as paintings from across her uh, cross-country travels. Mm -hmm. uh, we also have Margaret Ebton, and Margaret is uh, new to this show, and Margaret has a beautiful realism to her painting. Um, so definitely uh, someone to, to watch. We also have Marilyn Ferguson, who is a painter north of Brockville, and she does a lot of painting in um, winter scenes, predominantly uh, in the Algonquin area. So oh, uh, nice. gorgeous mm -hmm. um, handling of light, etc. Solange Les Mains is also an artist uh, with us. She's not new to the show, and she's going to be bringing a number of smalls. She does some very interesting work uh, on a smaller scale, so um, it will be an interesting show by Solange. Yes. Uh, Colleen O'Connell mm -hmm. is okay. uh, also with us. Colleen does amazing detail. Um, she does some beautiful collage work and uh, is very much inspired by her memories, by nature, mm -hmm. and um, by her gardens, who are, Beautiful gardens, are quite, yes. oh my goodness. <laughs> um, we also have Barbara Patrick mm -hmm. joining us. Barbara does some amazing work with uh, collage, with wonderful application of uh, different media to artwork, as well as very colorful art. Um, she, she also works in alcohol inks. We also have Bob Shackles, who is a, an award-winning artist and does um, both watercolor as well as oil. He's traveled the world doing a number of plein air uh, and art studies. Yes. And he'll bring anything from trips to the UK <laughs> and Italy to um, portraits to, uh, he's done a lot of studies with rowers. Mm -hmm. So, um, very interesting. Next we have Monique Van Summeren and Monique uh, has again a wonderful handling of detail and um, anything from interesting still lives but she also does some fascinating uh, insect and moth works oh. which are really quite intriguing. Yes. She also has got some of the most beautiful landscapes and handling mm -hmm. of uh, sun on the river that I've seen as well. Mm -hmm. And then finally, well, I guess not finally, I've got myself as well, but uh, Jan Traversy and Jan as well will do um, wonderful detail work or she has some 
beautiful abstractions that you can really get lost in. And you are? And Entering, you're, and you're, I'm. I'm also yes. going to be showing. Mm -hmm. um, I'll be showing oils yes. and alcohol inks, mm -hmm. and so it's a little bit of a um, two different, very different mediums. Mm -hmm. Oils three days on average to dry, so it takes a while to produce an oil painting. Alcohol inks each layer is about thirty seconds to sixty seconds, so it's a very different medium. Alcohol inks are brilliant in color and uh, and tone, so. Um, yeah, it's an exciting. Great. Uh, the, that lineup that you have right there of, of artists, uh, just, it's, yeah, people have to go to this. They have to go and just appreciate. Yes, um, yeah, come and what? walk through. It's free. Yeah. So we encourage people in the community and beyond to come through and just see what uh, local artists are producing in their own backyard. It's just extraordinary. It must be. It must be. Mm -hmm. And this is the time to actually talk to an artist about their work if you're interested in one of the mediums. This, this is the time to do it. You're absolutely right, yeah. Doreen. It's, um, it's a wonderful opportunity. All the artists will be there throughout the show. Um, I'm going to be doing some painting on the Saturday, so people might catch me doing a little bit of that. Yes. Uh, so it's, uh, we're going to try to make it interesting for all. Great. Mm -hmm. So uh, people can actually purchase yes, and they take can. away. That's right. That's so right. So now for them to pay for this, mm -hmm. um, can they pay with credit card? Can cash, e-transfer, all of this? All of the above. Yay, um, yay. Each artist will be looking after their own um, sales. Right. Um, e-transfer has become more and more popular. It's a wonderful, it is, uh, very yes. handy for both the purchaser mm -hmm. and the artist. Yeah. But most of us have squares, so we can take credit cards, debit cards, um, checks, cash is always welcome. So Good. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you ever so much for sitting are, down with me. I really appreciate it. You're most welcome, and thank you for having me. This is uh, wonderful to see the arts promoted in Brockville. It's our pleasure. Thank you.